Hello everybody and welcome back again to Let's Play Cyberpunk 2077 Phantom Liberty DLC. We're still trying to get the president to a safe location and again I'm currently on the pause screen because I don't want her to get too far away from me. But yeah, let's just resume and let's see um, if we can get her to safety finally. And yeah, I think Songbird is here as well. Spider and the fly go through so the So quiet, expo. I can hear my chrome creak. Quiet's a good sign. You think so? I generally prefer lively places. Hmm. I mean, quiet means no enemies around, right? So I would say yes, it's a good sign. Can I take a look at this computer over here? Got some messages. Opening week schedule. From Bix to Wedge. Well, that's a Star Wars reference. Sending you a general list of events of the inauguration, then I'll send a detailed breakdown for the crew. Familiarize yourselves with what's there. Reminder, no dips on specific tasks. I'll make sure to split them fairly. Here's a copy of what the participants received. The inauguration of founding our future expo is close at hand. Here are some activities you can look forward to. Day 1. Opening speech by none other than NUSA President Rosalind Myers, along with ceremonial ribbon cutting. Joseph Duarte's dazzling tenor performance. Champagne and various food treats in the first expo hall. Day 2. Jiang Yan Yi's sublime piano concert. A fireworks show illuminating progress on the outskirts of the district. Champagne and various hors d'oeuvres. Day 3. Security evolved Militech. Presentation of a new security prototype utilizing a dynamic heat signature analysis to monitor the emotions of a crowd. A stand with a variety of brand new Militech paraphernalia to test out. <laughs> Champagne and various hors d'oeuvres. There's lots of champagne to go around, apparently. The Dorf King's DJ duo with heat mapping of the audience broadcast in real time on the ceiling. <laughs> Day 4. A walk through the virtual reconstruction of the district center. A future of luxury panel with our shareholders. Champagne and various hors d'oeuvres. <laughs> Day 5. Joint concert of our musical talent, Joseph Duarte, Jiang Yan Yi, and the Dwarf Kings after party. What? No champagne? <laughs> I'm very disappointed. Are you cheapening out at the, at the end here? Every day you will have the opportunity to meet our co-investors and subcontractors at their workstations. Feel free to ask them questions or put forward your ideas and feedback. After all, we're here to celebrate our new future. That's about it. Lots and lots of work ahead of us. Plenty of overtime to be done. Be there or be square. No excuses. Okay. I wonder how long ago that was. I mean, clearly, we still, or we already had the same president. Expo cancelled. <laughs> From exhibition management to staff. Dear employees, the opening has been cancelled. As such, I regret to inform you that your employment has been terminated effective immediately. Before you contact us regarding this decision, please read section paragraph 5 additional terms and conditions of your employment contract. Best of luck in your future endeavors. Charles Moses. Uh, that is pretty abrupt. So what? Whole things cancelled? From bigs to staff, re-expo cancelled. Yup, the whole thing. Tried calling HR, but surprise, no answer. Read our contract, thing they pointed out, long story short, we are fucked. <laughs> I don't know, maybe you should have read your contract before signing it. Tensions are gonna rise, company's gonna get liquidated, start looking for a new job if you ask me. Prem, the press and Militech are fighting over who gets the bigger pot of gold and here I am begging my ex-boss to take me back. <laughs> Make sure to fuck some shit up before you leave. I have, believe me. You guys got any gigs going? If you need an extra, know where to find me. Yo, y'all know what's the sitch even about? Militech had issues or was NUSA getting all fussy about something? 
I don't know. Maybe DC's money well ran dry? <laughs> oh shit, listen to this. I read Malatek raised some village in Ecuador, was supposed to be stealth up but failed and then leaked and now they got a silence, the fallout, so my ass is flying around like crazy. Cause this is against NUSA's official stance, so you know. It's a matter of who can do what, washing your hands clean, who gave the op a green light and all sorts of nasty behind the scenes shit they're dealing with, so no one has time for expos and that kind of stuff. And now I regret asking. Okay. So Militech fucked up some stuff and no more expo. Interesting. But probably not all that relevant for us at the moment. Uh, I guess I'll take a look at this as well. Founding our future. Be more than an outcome of the past. Become the founder of the future. Welcome to Night City's Founding Our Future Innovation Expo. Our 14 interactive showrooms present cutting-edge tech created by Militech's best and brightest engineers, as well as planned and ongoing development investments in the district of Serenisens. We encourage you to check the Expo agenda and participate in all scheduled discussion panels and entertainment events. Our staff will gladly answer any questions you may have and help you reach your desired destination. There's no better place than here and no better time than now, for this is where the future starts. Come and found it with us. Sounds so uplifting. Um, okay, but let's see if we can talk to... Feel free to ask her about those exhibits. Songbird. Really wonder what she'll say. I don't know. Do you have something to say? Apparently... You were supposed to um, hold a speech here at some point. Militech HQ. A scan model, a model of an office complex comprised of three buildings. Building Militech HQ. Conclusion. Building complex of a new Militech HQ based at Night City never went beyond the planning stage. This is no time to stop and think. I don't know. I kind of want to take a look at this. It was an urban renewal effort, designed to curb Arasaka's growing influence. Militech backed most of the projects. So Militech sank money into Dogtown, too? That's not what it was called then, but yes. On paper, urban renewal. <laughs> Under that cover? Military infrastructure development. But abandon all hope of hearing a word of truth. I mean, that building looks like really, really ugly, though. It looks like some old tower computer. <laughs> I mean, maybe not this one, but the one in the middle. Uh, okay, um, there might be more stuff I can look at, so let's just continue. What is this, for example? The Heavy Hearts Club, scale model, mock-up of a pyramid shape building. Building Heavy Hearts Club, conclusion, purpose, service and entertainment currently occupied by the Heavy Hearts Club. That doesn't tell me anything at all. A I bright future. It. With the right financing. But wars scare off investors. Wars don't happen out of the blue. This? No exception. Orders were issued. There's the Rosalind Myers I know. Never a shadow of accountability. <laughs> okay, so we don't really know what this pyramid is all about. And what do we got here? Event height, resort and spa. Scale model mock-up of a tall building in the shape of a traditional coin. Building event height, resort and spa. Conclusion, purpose, service and entertainment currently occupied by members of a criminal organization. <laughs> okay. A gilded monument to a certain someone's bloated ego. <laughs> Takes one to no one. Alright, well, this is an interesting looking building. Also, hang on a second. There is some stuff going on up here. But I'm guessing it's somewhere up the stairs. Okay, I can force open this door. 
let me have a quick look at this. I'm guessing this is just a quick hacking game. Sure, let's let's uh, do this as well. Um, 7A, 55 here, and a 7A. There we go. And yeah, I guess I'll take all of this. And all of this. Okay, and this is a dead end. Um, okay, looks like that's all there is to this place. So let's join with the others again and let's move on. The way around this? Hmm. Well, I don't know. Do you have some idea, maybe? Songbird, got a sitch. Can you jimmy the door? Well, on it. Oh, the lock jammed. Gotta brute force it, V. All right. Time to roll up your sleeves. No need. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. Head for the elevator, just across the room. Huh. One of Hanson's warehouses, it seems. Gotta find an elevator, other side of the room. Alright, but hang on a second. There's a bunch of stuff that I would like to check out first. Ooh. That's a lot of ammo. I guess I'll take it all. Um, yeah, what else do we got here? There's more stuff over here. What is this? Work summary. Re Chimera. In order to breach the Chimera's ice, we need a hefty cluster of processors. At least four to five times the processing power we got at the moment. Individual decks attempting to breach it catch fire immediately. So we gotta quit screwing around and do this properly. What we'll need is one power, two cooling, three a way to constantly monitor the processors, four better decks for people trying to crack the ice. Overall it's a big investment and I don't know if we can squeeze all the cooling equipment here. Um, could build a cooling chamber? Doable. I can draw out some plans, JT. They use some old school RSA public key crypto systems to lock this bad boy down, so breaching it might take a month. So the question is, is it worth the weight and investment? Conclusion. Breaching Chimera's ice is possible, but it's gonna be super expensive and time consuming. The gear we got to do is far from sufficient. With the right financing, we should be able to breach it, but it'll still take a long as time. How long exactly? Impossible to tell. As Tollop. Okay. Again, not sure. What is it now? What they're Let's talking move, about? Um. Hang on a second. This is no time to stop and think. But I'm kind of fascinated by all the stuff that's going on here. This is no time to stop and think. Look at all the ammo. What is it now? Let's move, please. Yes, hang on a second. I want to take all of this with me. Um, and... There's something I can read. Important orders. 
For now, leave the machine be. Hansen got an offer from someone, from some general somewhere who sees pot potential in that heap of junk. Gist is, we're probably gonna sell. Meetings scheduled for next week, but until the decision to sell is final, don't go poking around the cables. If you break it, you pay to match the general's offer. Too long didn't read. <laughs> don't touch, don't fix, we sell as is. Okay. And... Yeah, I guess um, we have to use the elevator here. But I feel there's this like no time to stop and think. stuff going on somewhere over here, maybe. I'm not sure if I can get up there, though, so this might not be possible. Okay, um, let's just call the elevator. Maybe this will get us up there. What is it now? Let's move. Okay, here Please. goes. Well, v, do you hear that? Uh oh! Shit! Bastard's caught up to us again. Songbird. Hey, bad news this time. Hanson's dogs caught your scent. Assault incoming. You probably got spotted outside. Either way, get ready. Okay. But no. Got a surprise for our guests. Making the final adjustments now. Hold your position. Okay. Where's busy for a second. Need that. Where's the enemy? Myers, we gotta engage him. Song's on the case. Okay, I see I see some enemies. So they let's try to me. keep them off of us <gasps> while Songbird is doing whatever. I'm not seeing any other enemies so far. Okay, well, suddenly they're here. Here we go. Someone over here. Oh, uh, well, that's a grenade. Starting to heat up in here, Songbird. All right, we have got like a sniper over here. Working on it. Hold on tight. Let me take care of that guy. Right oh, and here. now they're coming from this side. Finally, we are being flanked. Almost there. Still melting ice for override. All right. Oh, um, you know what? This guy will get a system collapse. Hey, Gert. All right, this guy is almost dead. Not going to use any kind of quick hack on him. I will use some overheats on this guy. Oh, and now another one is coming from this angle. All right. Seventy percent. All right. Um. Yeah, there's some that are like up there, but some that are coming like 90. at us from the ground floor. That's the problem. Maybe try to get rid of these guys over here. Um, what? What is? What is happening? <laughs> anyway, let's just keep heading out overheats as much as we can. Oh, there's one over here. Oh, I see. She apparently activated one of. Machines here. Alright, if it's going to help us, I'm all for it. And suddenly, they're even coming from like behind us. I don't like that at all. Oh. Okay, support the Chimera in the fight against Hansen's people. Oh, that's the Chimera and that we just ran we're about. Clear. I detect no more. What? What? Oh god, what? <laughs> um, can you please be a little bit more specific? What is happening? What is happening? Songbird, what's with you? Uh oh. Something is going very, very what wrong here. What the hell is going on, V? 
I have no idea. Dunno, Song's having a fit or something! Um... 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 Is... is... is the camera still friendly? Uh, nope. Nope, it's not. Son of a bitch went haywire! For fuck's yep. sake, Zumi! Slap a muzzle on the thing! <laughs> yeah, I can't... I can't Through hit here. this thing at all. Through here! Alright, um, I guess... We will have to run away from this. Yep. I'm coming. <laughs> Great. Maybe this was a little bit too much for you, Song, but maybe you On shouldn't have Run! Uh, woken up this beast. Oh dear. Let's try to get away from it. Oh, oh, oh. Up here! Escalator, go! I'm already like running no! as fast as I can. Oh no. <laughs> uh, what what did I do wrong? I, I was already running as fast as I could. Okay, let's just um, do this again, I suppose. I'm not sure where the last save was. I hope there was an order save not too long ago. Okay, so we're starting back at this door. But uh, the chimera is just breaking through. Find your feet! Run! <sighs> I mean, the problem is that I, I can't I can't sprint. I can't jump. Up here! Escalator, I can only move go. forward at this very slow velocity. Okay, now now it lets me sprint. Through here, babe. Right. Up there. Elevator. Yep, now I can actually sprint normally. For some reason it didn't work the first time. Alright. There's the elevator. Elevator on the way. Um God fucking damn it! Oh, um, I was trying to take some cover here, but that didn't work. And yeah, I still, still can't hack that thing. I'm not sure if shooting it will accomplish a lot. <laughs> Survive against the chimera until the elevator arrives. Okay. Elevator. All right, elevator has arrived. Myers, get in! Oh, oh no. Shit. Well, um I, I guess rough gonna get rough. She got the elevator. But I didn't. Oh boy. Oh boy. What now? Well, uh, I guess I'm going to jump. Grab the cables! <laughs> Where the hell am I? <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm like right, right um, oh, below it. Of course. Uh. Songbird, um, that was not a good idea. <laughs> Bringing the thing back to life was not a good idea. V! I'm still alive, I think. You're not dying on me today. <sighs> no. <sighs> Guess not. Right. Good. So, um, is that thing finally dead? We take it out? The fall did. About time we caught a break. Hmm. <clears throat> Can't stay here. Are you mobile? Um, 
I think I think it's still alive. <laughs> we need to get out of here. Will you just die? The fall wrecked it! Let's go! Kick this kick out of hell! And now we have to defeat it. Let's see. What options do we have? Short circuit. Sure. Let's hit it with a bunch of so Drop short the bastard. circuits. Hit the exposed bit! It's our only chance! Right. Yes, I will try to do that. So it has like some weak spots like this over here. Um uh oh. I'll fucking destroy you. <laughs> um well, first of all, I need to make sure it doesn't destroy me. Um Alright. I don't know. I'm I'm just going to keep hitting it with a few <coughs> short circuits. Oh dear. My attempt to fight some What's cover here are uh, always getting spoiled. Um, also, maybe I can also try some overheats here. I mean, it's doing some damage. Yeah. Right, that did certainly something. Right. Um. And let's just. Yeah, that's right. We got it. it. With a bunch of overheats. Hey, watch out! But I need to find a better place Shit, to take some cover yet. here. <laughs> yep, yep. I I understand. It's not that yet. Ten drones. Go left. Pass here. The fat one. Okay, we got some drones. Um. <coughs> guess I will go for the drones. You die already? There you go. Alright. Let's take a bit of cover for a second and. Go for the drones. I'm I'm hanging in there. <laughs> But I need to be careful. Okay, so the drones are repairing. Um Chimera. So I guess uh, it's a good idea to destroy them. I mean, this one is almost destroyed. There we go. And there's another one over here. One more. All right. And there we go. I think we destroyed the drones. And now we can continue with the Chimera. <laughs> Uh oh, uh oh. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> this is going to take a while. I'm even too scared to use my overclock because it's going to cost me a lot of health. Um, up, 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 up. Careful. Um, again. A few short circuits. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> Ah, this is difficult. Okay, guess I'll have to do this again. I need to find a better place to take cover, I suppose. I guess I have to start the battle all over again now, huh? <laughs> the fall wrecked it. Alright, so we're going to start at the beginning again. Um, let me have a quick look at the info here. Okay, it's weak against electricity, but not against heat. So I should just use my short circuit and not my overheat, I guess. Drop right, the bastard! Hit the exposed bit! It's our only chance! There we go. Oh, well. Okay? Nope. I am not okay. <laughs> but I don't really have any other choice here, huh? Right, uh... I'm gonna fucking destroy you! More short circuits for you. And... <clears throat> let's try to hit... Scan one it of me. these things again. The gaps in the armor. Yep, I, I saw the gaps in the armor, but... Oh, um... There is no actual... Opening here that I can use. Okay, but I still need... Watch the laser! I still Take need a cover. cover. 
Right. There we go. Um. Let's see. Might be able to hit this from here. Yeah, that's right. We, go. we got it. Yep, it. It's it's not dead yet. It's just going to try to Shit, repair itself. So. Not dead yet. Look alive. Tech drones. Yep. And now we have to deal with the drones. Let me maybe use an overclock here so I can quickly dispose of the drones. Um, and there's one over here. You die already? There's another one over here. Let's short circuit all of them. Um, okay, I need v, to get a better angle okay to get the other drones here. Okay, there's another one over here. Hang it in. All one right. More. We got the drones, but now <coughs> the chimera is coming back. <coughs> I'll take some cover over here. And again... And out some short circuits. Ooh. Where the hell am I? <laughs> okay, I think this is a relatively safe cover for the time being anyway. Okay, we have like a weak spot opening right here. Let me put some overheat to the drones. Up. Able to avoid that laser. And that was like another weak spot. Alright. Now I will try to find a different position to Watch attack the laser. some other weak spots. Alright, here we go. Perfect. And a few more short circuits for you. Uh, oh, well, careful. Uh, and more short circuits. Uh, 28%. Hang in there! I'm trying, but. I will need a different position again because I can't reach any other weak spots at the moment. Okay, there's one over here. Right, more short circuits. Oop, well, careful. Careful. Oh, my cover is getting fewer and fewer. <laughs> oh boy. Um, let's see, this might be useful cover for the time being. Well, careful, laser, and there's another weak spot I can target. All right, just 5%. I hope this is going to finish it off now. 2%. Come on, just die. Jump on top and finish it, V! Jump on top. Okay. Catch me now or never. Send it to the scrapyard. All right, let's do it. All right. Ooh. V, catch. Give it a taste. <laughs> Rusting piss, shitbot. <laughs> well, good thing you were able to think of a snappy one-liner before. Nicely done. <laughs> Good Ooh. fucking wins. Well, there was something. Take the Chimera score. Yes, I definitely want to loot that thing before I move on. This was difficult. Um, let's see. How do I find the core? Um, I'm not seeing it. Well, there's something over here, but that's probably something else, right? 
Where's the core? Safeguarding the nation. My ass. <laughs> <sighs> Close call, that. Good teamwork. And luck. A pile of luck, me. Yeah, I wonder what happened to what a songbird. Let's head out. There has to be an exit here, somewhere. Um, I'm, I'm still trying to find that core. Maybe if I mark this quest as active, it will tell me where to look for it. <laughs> oh, it's over here. Well, <laughs> this doesn't look like much. Somehow I was expecting something more impressive, to be honest. But sure, I'll take it. There we go. Find an entrance to the subway tunnels. And apparently the quest is called Lucretia My Reflection. Now that's an awesome song. Sisters of Mercy. I can wholeheartedly recommend that. But okay, um, I guess we will move on from here. Let me have a quick hmm. look around. What's this? Ah, that's where we have to go, presumably. But we do have like a bunch of stuff here. And I think now I understand why they gave us so much ammo before entering this place. I don't think I have used that much ammo um, in this entire game so far. This is always a problem if you're not really specialized for that kind of you know, combat style and suddenly you're kind of forced to, you know, fight an open battle that mainly relies on guns. But I think uh, it went well enough. Good stuff. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Hmm. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Dead quiet. Still. Not good. Not good. Come on! The fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? Well, I can jump. <laughs> what about you? Alright, she can climb. Hold up, V. Let's pause. Think for a sec. What's eating you? I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Well, is it a good idea to stop here? Stopping's not a good idea. We get pinned down. We're ground synth beef. Exactly. But so me can guide us out of this death trap. Call her, please. All right, sure. Let's do it. Okay, gonna give it a shot. I need a songbird. Starting to worry us, girl. Hmm. Song, are you there? No answer, huh? Oh, Guess he's you back. Guess me and only me. <laughs> Welcome back. Great to see you again, Johnny. <laughs> Curb the enthusiasm, kid. Never know. Could need me. So? Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. What happened back there? With so me. She was attacked, maybe. I don't know, probably. Something was off for sure. Could say she got hit with a demon, maybe tripped a defense protocol on the Chimera's ice. Could say. Mm hmm. If Songbird was a cookie cutter runner. Both know she's not, though. Damn fucking straight. <laughs> but who knows? Nah. Whole thing was a clusterfuck. You know. Knowing that run comes without a burn risk. No. Impossible. Well, Somi's had occasional off moments lately. Temporary slumps. But I'm sure she's headed where we're headed. Same destination she gave us. It's the reasonable thing to do. Right. Reasonable. Girl's gonna have a hell of a hangover. <laughs> if she wakes up. 
Shit time for jokes, what makes you say that? Yes, what makes you say that? Hey, you figure that. Because I wound up at the same rave she went to. Felt like I was underwater. Leagues down. Tried to surface, but this suffocating, hmm. sucking sound pulled me back in. Then when she lost control of the chimera, the water turned into fucking boiling tar. Interesting. Sounds unsettling to say the least. Yep. Seems like the sitch spiraled out of control. Amen to that. Though actually, could have been a straight overload. Seen runners caught in those. Shit's ugly. So, can we move on? Yep, I think we can move on. I just um, had to have a little talk with myself. <laughs> And I mean, we did read the pad, which mentioned that the Chimera had like very uh, strong ice, which is like anti-hacking technology, right? So I guess it's not a surprise that uh, Songbird wasn't really able to penetrate it completely. Anyway, let's keep going. I want to get out of this place. We're heading southwest now. Uh-oh. Feels like we're circling back. Uh-oh. Uh -huh. Song mentioned an abandoned building, place to lie low. No heat sick, so should be relatively safe. I pray you're right, so me. I have like a twitchy display, which usually means like a relic malfunction. But now it's gone again, so I don't know, maybe I'm fine. Just keep going. Um, now what? I guess we're supposed to drop down here. Pushable, you think? Hmm. Let's Could try use a little it. help. Of course. Oh! A damn fork? Well, we didn't account for this. Hmm. Which way now? Thoughts? Hmm. Find a way out of the tunnels. Um, I mean, this tunnel looks more promising on my mini map, but let's have a quick look at this one too. Let's try this way. Looks promising. Cameras? Here? Use your eyes. Oh, what the hell? Um, let's turn it off. Ah, hmm. oh, is Satan's balls in here? Should plug that. Look for a valve. A valve. Yep, there's one here. There we go. But we can just go through here, apparently. Uh oh. Well, yep. I think the relic malfunction is still coming. And we got another camera. Turn that off as well. By the way, can I take control of it and see how many more we have? Nope. They do not seem to be connected, apparently. Alright. Ooh. Looks like a control room. Well, there's a bunch of stuff here, um, including. Computer. Remember the Red Decades. Let me have a look at that. Uh, let's be real. What kind of person was Elizabeth Cress? Does she really deserve monuments or streets named after her? Elizabeth Cress Street near the confines of Night City is a twisted joke. Once again, the 1% try to shove NUSA Militech propaganda down our throats and force us to swallow it. It's a lie perpetuated by the elite in an effort to evoke an illusionary patriotic sentiment. This is not enough to whitewash history, not enough to make us forget the ruins on which Night City was built, the red cloud of devastation hanging over the continent, the rain thick as blood. By building this district, by building Crest Street, this is what we see, not a president of the people, but the violence that her name recalls, violence and scorched earth, nuclear devastation, the red decades. 
Never heard that name before. Okay, but um, let's take a look at this computer. Um, apparently I can wipe the recordings. I'm not sure why I want that, but I guess um, I will do it anyway. <laughs> Uh, 55 1C, 55 BD. I guess it's the recording of the camera that may have recorded us. Right? Yeah, I guess that's what's going on here. In that case, that's probably a good idea to um, destroy these recordings. Um, anything else here that I should take with me? And the rest is just normal loot. Where the hell are we now? Elizabeth Crest Street. Bullheaded Betty, that's what we called her. Re-elected nine times. Can you believe it? She must have had her ass welded <laughs> to that seat. Funny how she has her own street in Night City of all places. That jealousy I'm detecting? Please. Jealous of what? I mean, people don't seem to be all that happy about that street and the fact that it's named after this person. And here we go again with uh, the potential relic malfunction. <laughs> oh dear, it's getting worse, I think. Now, um, since the episode is getting kind of long, I may actually want to make a cut here and we will try to find our way out of these tunnels in the next episode and we may encounter another relic malfunction the way things are going. But for the time being, let's call it a day as always. Thank you for watching and see you again next time.